Hi friends, welcome to free online tech videos. In this video session, we are going to see about fdisk command. My name is Ravi. Let's see that what fdisk command will do here. Okay, now if you want to execute fdisk command, which is a administrator com administration command required root privileges to execute so just i'm switching back to the root user okay so f disk in the sense format disk ir fixed disk okay so any you can say format disk or fixed disk the f disk is utility is used to create the partitions delete the partitions okay you can change the uh, partitions ids and you can change the boot flags okay you can do anything on the disks or you can also format the drives but you have to use very carefully because if you mess up anything or the path or anything so your data is going to be formatted or your data is going to be uh, deleted kind of stuff okay that's why I you I say that the caution is that note please do only if you know what you are doing or else do not do anything because this command may cause your system going to be lost okay do practice this command only on the environment which is your personal systems or laptops that's okay no problem but do not try this on any of your production machines directly if until unless you do not know the uh, what is the impact on that let's see that you have disk you can just use iphone l which will provide you the all the device information and partition information so which is going by default if you do not provide any path which is going to show all the disk information okay like this i don't want to see all the disk information i would like to see only slash dv slash sda so how many what is the disk size is there here the disk size is 32 gb of uh, sda and this many bytes if you convert into the bytes and this many sectors which is created on that system and uh, one sector this sector equal to 512 bytes in the sense if you do 512 bytes into this many sectors you are going to get the size of 32 gb okay the sector size is logical slash physical both are 512 bytes only okay the io size the minimal and maximum optimal is 512 bytes okay and disk label is das partition which is not gpt partition if it is on a gpt partition the f disk is not the utility to maintain the gpt partitions which does not maintain perfectly using the f disk okay if that is only the um, utility does not have that feasibility to maintain gpt partitions or the larger partition sizes okay f disk only maintain until 16 tb 17 tb sizes not more than that but the logical or uh, the physical things is that more than 2.5 tb or 3tb 3 3tb can only be maintained by using the f disk utility now f disk can also provide you the disk size by providing the uh, f disk slash s slash sda so this is the size of SDA partition we already see that that is 32 GB the 32 GB is converted into the bytes this many bytes you can create the partitions or delete the partitions print the uh, information of the disk you can see of disk f and l there are so many drives here so let's go to some partition is that which do not have any partition the SDE I have and f disk slash dv slash SDE go to that disk and uh, type m in which will provide you the help all the options so for creating the new partition you have to type n this this one and uh, printing the information of the table you can use p so writing the confirmation to the disk you have to w and quit from this utility you can type q colon q colon w 
so it will be executed from this or you can just type w echo it will write and execute from the here so you can also change the um, disk labels and uh, change partition ids so this is the partition id change you can do that using the f1t option so this is a f disk utility options there are so many listing the partition types how many partition types we have there are so many partition types the f disk supports for like example say l so it will provide all the partition types which is which you can do on this f disk utility there are so many okay let's not go there let's create some partition here and see n for partition and primary so the any operating system can only create four primary or three primary one extended okay let's say the first partition is primary and the partition number is one and the size is okay here i would like to give example one gb in size the partition size i am going to create out of range that's okay now p for printing the partition type so partition information partition table information which is not updated to your kernel yet so you have to update using the other commands so this is the device is created the first partition number is one partition number is one and it is starts from the this sector to this sector this many blocks which is start to end blocks this many blocks has been created created in this drive and this is this many sectors is used you can see that sector number from 2048 to this now last number and this many blocks has been created the id of this partition type is 83 and the file system is linux you can also change this partition type okay using the t option so in this you have to provide the code i already showed you the what is the codes here over here these are the codes you can use any type of the code which you wanted to convert the drive to this type okay example say linux lvm partition you can use that to convert our current existing partition id is 83 so i'm not changing anything here so linux to linux w q save the information and quit back and just to do a part probe to update your kernel to see your information on this now have this ivan l slash dv slash sde which will provide you the partition information okay let's format the ext4 slash dv slash sde1 okay do not mess up anything here because whenever you it enter it will format everything and it will create the new file system for that disk okay let's see that so you can also do any extended things on this sde example i'm going to do slash dv slash sde if you want to delete that partition you can also use d for delete the partition has been deleted if you can see that the partition is empty you can say wq and part pro so that f disk f and l slash dv slash sde the partition has been deleted here you can do so many extra things also using slash f disk things okay which is extended operations are the expert operations you can do over here using the x option let's see m for help so these are the expert options you can do in the linux okay there are many things you can do f disk but this is only the major task to list out and um, uh, creating the partitions and deleting the partition changing the types of the partition types all the stuff you can do using the fdisk command quit from the utility and uh, that's about fdisk command straight forward okay thanks for watching stay tuned please subscribe to the channel for more updates please follow us on social networking sites 
If you have any technical related questions, you can ask.